Hi, and thank you for joining us on a walk with God. And I'm just out on a walk with my with my grandkids, and I just wanted to uh, touch base on something that could be uh, very hard and disturbing for some people. Is the fact that uh, you know when the rapture comes, all of the children will be removed off the earth. Jesus Christ Himself says that. Uh, what a terrible day it will be for pregnant and nursing mothers. And so you have to really begin to ask yourself, uh, if you're putting your faith in this world, that you know, when, when, when Jesus Christ comes to remove all of his body, remove his church, remove his loved ones, all of the children are going to be taken at the same time. And so if you're on the fence about the rapture, or if you're on the fence about this whole thing with Christianity, you have to remember something, uh, God will come, Jesus Christ will come and remove the children at the same time he removed this church. And so all those left behind, uh, all those that will endure the tribulation, you're going to endure the tribulation without any children. And I'm, I'm guessing that, and I, I don't know this for certain, but I'm guessing that uh, nobody will become pregnant. No woman will be able to become pregnant during the tribulation because at that time the restrainer is going to be removed off the earth. Uh, the Holy Spirit will, will lift his hand of grace. God will lift his hand of grace off of mankind and the tribulation will begin. And so again, Jesus Christ himself says that what a terrible date will be, especially for mothers who are nursing and who are pregnant. So guys, please, today, if, if this whole thing about the rapture and the tribulation, if it's something new or if you're, if you're trying to ignore it, ignoring it will not make it go away. These little ones you see before me, when the tribulation comes, when the, when the, you almost when, get to the treasure. That's right. We're all, she says we're almost, we're almost there to the treasure. And that is so true, out of the mouth of babes. So when Jesus Christ comes to remove his loved ones off the earth, he's going to remove the little ones. He's going to remove the children. He's going to remove the children off the earth. And so today, please guys, it is so important that we focus our affections 100% on the only one who saves, Yahshua HaMashiach, the Lord Jesus Christ. Confess that he is Lord. Believe that God, his Father, raised him from the dead. And give him your sins. Confess your sins to him and then go and sin no more. Help others. Love others. Help those in need. Help those who do not know about what we're talking about. Uh, let, let people know about Jesus Christ. Let them know about his love and his grace, but also about the fact he's coming back soon. So anyway, again, what a terrible day it will be. Especially from nursing and pregnant mothers because one will be at the millstone because the other will be taken. Two will be laying in bed and one will be taken. All of the children will be taken off the earth. This is serious, guys. Our time is short. Please, today, give your life to Jesus Christ. Commit yourself to him. And understand that when he comes, he's going to come and take all the children off the earth when he comes to remove his church, his bride, his loved ones. Anyway, I hope this makes sense, and I hope that you actually uh, study this for yourself. There's a, a big movement in what they, what the people call themselves the body of Christ that don't believe, and the rapture don't believe that he's coming back, don't believe, uh, or don't want to believe. It's, it's sad. Jesus Christ will return. He's coming back soon. When he does, he is going to take the little ones as well as those who love and follow him. I hope you have a blessed and wonderful day. And it's in Jesus' precious and holy name I pray. Amen.